Hi, I'm Dr. Nazri Mokhtar. I'm here to highlight the results of a clinical trial that was conducted by a renowned hospital in Singapore and was published in 2021. Diabetes is an acquired disease due to lifestyle and nearly 90 to 95% of this diabetes is type 2 diabetes. Research studies have long established that people with type 2 diabetes have lower oxygen concentration in their body or in their tissues. Allo oxygen rich water was adopted by these doctors in a clinical trial to observe effect on tissue oxygenation. And this is because allo oxygen rich water is able to stably hold the oxygen content without the use of chemicals. A total of 150 type 2 diabetic patients from Changi General Hospital Diabetic Center were involved in this trial. The inclusion criteria was that they had to have a HbA1c of 8 and above. 90% of these patients have diabetes for over 5 years, and many of them more than 10 years. In this trial, half of the volunteers were given aloe water to drink, and half of the other volunteers are given normal water to drink. The volunteers were not told whether they were drinking aloe or normal water, and they had to drink 1.5 liters of water daily for the next three months. There were no changes in the dosages of their medication. The researchers who tested the blood samples of these volunteers were also not aware of what the patients or volunteers were drinking. In other words, this is a double-blind randomized controlled trial. In summary, the positive findings of these clinical trials demonstrate Long-term consumption of aloe water of more than six weeks may benefit diabetic patients to help them achieve better glucose control, to lower HbA1c levels even for people with more than 10 years of diabetes. Aloe water's effect on lowering blood glucose in diabetic patients is both clinically and statistically significant. The HbA1c lowering effect of at least 0.5% is comparable to most diabetic drugs. Drinking aloe water for one week increases your blood oxygenation by more than two times. Diabetic patients may experience higher energy levels when they drink aloe water regularly. It's possible that with regular consumption of aloe, the overall well-being of diabetic patients can be improved and the risk of diabetic complication may be minimized. Drinking aloe water boosts the cell's oxygenation and thereby improves mitochondrial function. And in sequelae to that, the production of insulin by the pancreas is also improved. Although the main route of oxygenation is through the lungs, but clinical trials have also shown that you can absorb oxygen through the walls of your intestine. The oxygen dissolves into the plasma, which circulate around the body, carrying the oxygen to the rest of the tissues within our system. Aloe water with its stable oxygen can be used effectively to increase oxygenation and to also to hydrate patients, thereby a two-in-one solution. Hello.